greetings. Uh, you ever notice how Caribbean people have called themselves West Indians or nationalize themselves? Depending on which island them come from, them either be Jamaican, Trinidadian, etc., etc. We must connect to our ancestral land. Every other nation, when they are tracing them ancestry, them trace it to them ancestors' land. Anytime we talk about ourselves, we stop at West Indian. Christopher Columbus thought that he was in India. And because he was traveling west, it was said to be the west of India. The West Indies is not an original name for the people them who were enslaved in this part of the earth. You can be a Jamaican and an African at the same time, but most of us don't want to say we are African. Because them beat that out of way. Centuries of beating. 500 years of slavery and colonialism. Them take out the African out of way and implant it with the little island them. This farmer slave plantation island. And then for a wider case, them say we are Caribbean people. Exempting the African in us. Because our Wally Power say, I never born in Africa. So I know no African. You don't have to burn in Africa to be African. If a cow born in a pig pen, it don't make him a pig. It means a cow, him go move the same way. African people is the only people who run up and down the place and say, me no African, me a West Indian. Yet still you have a Chinese man who never go to China yet. Never. And you call him a Chinese. Oh, you know him is a Chinese. And he never go to China yet. Oh, you know, say this man is a European. And a whole heap of them born everywhere else except Europe. But them keep them identity. Identity is a thing that you have. Identity is a thing that you cannot escape from. So no matter where you come from, as long as you're a black man, you're an African. And we have to recognize Africa first. Because you can be a national of any country. A white man can come a Jamaica and get nationalized into being a Jamaican. But guess what? A leopard can't change his spot. Can't change it. We as Africans trying to change his spot. That is why all the people are trying to get rid of our complexion. Trying to adopt another language trying to look like the colonizers. But something innately, the, our DNA save us. And we don't recognize our DNA. We is African people first. Anything else come because we get domiciled in the place that we find ourselves in. But we must stop disrespecting our ancestors because our ancestors came here not by free will, but by force. And it is the desire of many of us to find that connection that is implanted in our DNA to recognize how important it is to identify with the land of our ancestors, Africa, Ireland.